What is a share? A share is simply part ownership of a business. Therefore, owning all the shares in a company implies that you had bought over the company in the company name such as XYZ Limited will change to XYZ Private Limited. There are two primary reasons why companies issue shares. A. Raise money for future development such as expanding their market presence or B. The owner want to sell part of his business ownership so as to diversify his business portfolio. What will shareholders receive? When you bought shares of a company, you become one of the owners in the company and get to share the company profits. However, as a shareholder, when the company goes into liquidation or bankruptcy, the shareholder have the last rights over the assets of the company. Thus, you could lose your money. How are shares created? There are two ways a company can issue shares. The first is the primary market, through initial public offering known as IPO. The second way is in the secondary market after the company had went IPO. The IPO is where the company issues shares for the first time. Depending on the company market capital, the company lodges the offer documents with Monetary Authority of Singapore or the Singapore Stock Exchange. Such documents is known as a prospectus. If an investor wants to buy shares in an IPO, he must then review the prospectus. The prices of the shares is determined by the company which is stated on the prospectus. Applying for shares in the primary market You could obtain a copy of the prospectus from bank branches in Singapore. If you want to buy the shares during the IPO and have reviewed the prospectus, you may then proceed to the nearest auto teller machine and key in the numbers of shares you wanted. Your money from your bank account will then be transferred to the company for the amount of shares that you had entered. You could be allocated all the shares you want receive a portion, or may not receive any at all. If you don't receive all the shares you want, you will be refunded for the remaining amount. How many shares can a company issue? Consider a company that does not have any debts, with its assets that is worth $100 million. The company can issue 100 million shares at $1 each, or 50 million shares at $2 each, or 200 million shares at 50 cents each. In any of these examples, the market value, also known as market capital, is the same at $100 million. Buying shares during an IPO will incur a nominal fee of about $2 for most bank, but it does not incur brokerages charges, however the selling of the shares will trading of the shares in Singapore Stock Exchange, also known as SGX, will commences after the shares have been issued, and AAS, or SGX approval has been granted. Buying and selling of shares in the secondary market. After the shares have been listed in the stock market, investor will then be able to buy or sell shares in the Singapore Stock Exchange. Investor buy or sell shares mainly in the secondary market since IPO are shares that are offered for the first time. If you have successfully applied for the shares during the IPO, you can then offer to sell them in the share market via online trading platform or via your stockbroker, also known as Reminder. If you were not allocated any shares during the IPO and is interested in the shares issued by the company, you can buy them via the secondary market. Share ownership. The transfer of the shares certificate and cash between seller and buyer is called settlement. Settlement S is largely done by CDP which is a subsidiary of SGX. This occurs within three days after the trade. As a share owner, your name will be entered in the company register maintained by CDP. In this way, the listed companies no longer need to allocate an employee to manage the share register. The 20 largest shareholder are usually found in the last few pages of the company annual reports.
any changes in director's ownership of the company or significant shareholders could be found in the SGX website or the respective company investor relations web pages. We hope you find this tutorial useful.